I grew up in a really strong Southern Baptist home, and um, my mama was a really good singer. And uh, that's where I first learned how to play piano. So standing beside her in church, listening to her sing harmony is kind of where I learned how to sing harmony. Hello. I'd have to say my musical hero is, uh, I got several of them. I mean, obviously my mama growing up, she was, uh, she was always there. My sister, she, she basically got me started. She got me into, or talked me into joining my very first singing contest. Um, but as far as a country singers go, Travis Tritt is, is definitely my favorite. He, uh, he, he always knew how to bring it. Soul, R&B, country, bluegrass, gospel, didn't matter. He, uh, he always knew how to deliver. So. When I graduated high school is when I put my first band together. So we uh, got my first gig out of town. I didn't have a van. I didn't have a trailer. So I borrowed a trailer. We took two trucks. I had a truck. My bass player had a truck. Uh, we drove to Virginia. And on the way back, 10, 15 miles into our trip, uh, my bass player's transmission went bad. So uh, he drove the rest of the way home, which was about 10 hours in second gear. I had a lot of goals when I moved to Nashville. I've been here almost 10 years. And I wanted a record deal. I wanted to, wanted to have a song on the radio. I wanted, to, um, I wanted to play on the Grand Ole Opry. I've gotten to do all of that. Uh, so from here on out, I just wanna, I just wanna succeed. I wanna, I wanna have longevity. I wanna be on the radio for a long time. So as long as country music is good to me, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be good to them. The first time I saw uh, McPherson guitar, my first thought was, wow, the sound hole's in an odd spot. But um, it wasn't until I picked up one that I realized that they were uh, leaps and bounds sound better than any other acoustic I'd ever picked up. McPherson guitars are consistently one of the best sounding acoustic guitars on the, on the market. Uh, the sound hole being where it is and, and the, uh, the neck not being on top of the, uh, on the face of the guitar gives it a bigger, fuller sound with a good sustain. And, and that's, that's what I'm looking for in an acoustic guitar.